Hey guys, Rook Knight here. Thanks for joining me. I thought we'd take a crack at a disc detainer lock. Haven't done one of these in a very long time. Um, so I got this one here. I, it looks like FU Volante, but it probably isn't. But it, it really does look like it says FU Volante on it. So we're going to go with the FU lock. It's got an SUS309, which is probably the steel. Um, it is Chinese, I'm sure, but it's a very nice quality. I mean, it's just really beautiful, very heavy, very, very nice to look at. Um, just seems like a really well-made one um, before we start off We show it in operation lock it up We are locked nice and tight Gonna use the sparrows disc detainer pick today with uh, one of the homemade pick tips and my homemade disc Turner rotator whatever you want to call it I always like using a little bump ring. It just gives me that, uh, allowing me to keep tension only on the first disc. Even if you have this neck all the way pulled up into the Sparrow's disc detainer, um, uh, it just doesn't work. It, it still will grab a hold of two discs and you don't want that. So line yourself up, put a little tension, sink it in. Make sure you can go up and down the column. Make sure you're level. And without any further ado, Start testing. I felt okay. That feels loose. There's definitely gates and false gates in this one. Trying to line myself up here. Just keep going up and down the column and keep feeling out what feels right. Gonna go back on this one. I don't like the way that feels now. All right, that's a little better. I go this way oh, there we go I think I got it yes sir there we go that's not bad at all that last one was a little tricky had to go the opposite direction I went first tried to go um, uh, counterclockwise but then had to go clockwise in order to get it open but there we go guys it's not bad um, really happy um, I haven't picked a disc container in a little bit had some time thought I'd flick on the camera and give it a go Apparently, I'm still good at disc detainer locks. <laughs> I'm not too shabby on the pins, but I definitely still got a knack for these. All right, uh, that's all I got for today, guys. I hope everybody's doing well. Catch you on the flip side. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.